What's up guys, it's Meathead Minute time again. You may be asking yourself, what is that horrible thing growing on Seth's upper lip? Um, well, that's a mustache, and you might be asking yourself why. Well, there's a few reasons. For one, many a great man in history has worn the mustache. Teddy Roosevelt, Tom Selleck, Apollo Creed, Lando Calrissian, and of course, Rod Farva. Now, there's another reason for this, and that's because it is Movember. Movember is a time to raise awareness for men's health. And in our clinic, a number of us residents are doing this to partially, you know, just to grow go gross mustaches, but also to raise awareness for men's health. When most people think about it, they think about prostate cancer, testicular cancer, um, but there are other aspects to men's health that are equally as important. Now, this isn't to say there shouldn't be any type of screening for that. If you are between the ages of 18 and 30, you should be checking your balls. If you are over the age of 40, um, you should be talking to your doctor about prostate cancer screening. Typically over the age of 50 is when that screening starts. Now, in addition to those problems, there's a lot of other causes of death in men that can be addressed preemptively. Um, in young men ages 15 to 44, uh, unintentional injuries are actually the number one cause of death. Um, I'm looking down because my computer's right here. I can't remember all these statistics offhand. And as we go down the line, number two, ages 15 to 34, is suicide. Um, the rate of that is way too high, and that's something we've addressed previously, but if you're having any mental health issues, please, please talk to somebody. Um, the big one as we age is heart disease, and in addition to that, cancer. Both of these things, in many cases, can be preventable. You know, especially in the case of strength athletes where we're pushing our bodies to the limit, we're pushing our size to the limit. Um, heart disease can be a big issue. Uh, blood pressure goes up as your weight goes up. Your lipid profile, especially if you're using performance enhancing drugs, may be unfavorable. In addition to that, your hematocrit may go up from using these medications, well, supplements, whatever you wanna call them as well. So it's really important that if you're, you're doing that type of stuff, not judging, but you should be getting yourself checked out. You should be getting labs done. Um, just the sheer factor of size as a strength athlete can also be dangerous from a cardiac standpoint. So make sure that you're doing cardiovascular training as well. From a cancer standpoint, screening is very important. Colonoscopy, prostate cancer screening, testicular cancer screening, all of these things are great. But if you are doing things that can lead to cancer, that's not gonna help you. So smoking, dipping, high nitrite foods, things like that. Some of those have increased cancer risks, um, and we all know that you probably shouldn't be smoking as an athlete. There are many, many other aspects to men's health that I'm not gonna cover here, um, but looking at this list, you know, we've got stroke, we've got heart disease, unintentional injuries, that means when you're doing stupid stuff. Um, chronic lower respiratory diseases, so COPD, emphysema, these things caused by smoking. A lot of these things are preventable, so, in honor of Movember, this mustache is telling you to get your labs checked, do your cancer screenings, and just take care of yourself. Um, it's, it's something that's very important, and we as men can do better. All right, Dr. Meathead out.